Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. Welcome back to the Halal Times YouTube channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic, the journey of Turkey's economy for the past 30 years and what the future holds for this economy. If you're new to this channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give us a thumbs up if you enjoy this video. So let's get started. Let's start with the 1990s, a decade marked by the economic turbulence for Turkey, high inflation rates reaching up to 105% in 1994, coupled with political instability, made this period quite challenging for the people of this beautiful country. The government at that time, they struggled to implement consistent economic policies, leading to frequent financial crises. Fast forward to the early 2000s, and we see a significant economic turn around. Under the leadership of then Prime Minister Tayyip Erdogan, Turkey underwent major economic reforms. With the support of the International Monetary Fund at that time, Turkey stabilized its economy through structural changes in banking, privatization, and fiscal policies. And you know what happened as a result of these beneficial economic policies? These efforts basically paid off as Turkey enjoyed robust economic growth, averaging around 7% annually. Inflation was brought down to a single digit and the Turkish lira was revalued, signaling a new era of stability. But of course, as you might expect, the journey wasn't quite smooth sailing. The last decade brought its own set of challenges for the economy. Geographical tensions, a failed COP attempt in 2016, and the growing autocratic governance. These issues raised concerns among investors and impacted economic stability. And you know what the current situation is as far as this economy is concerned? Inflation has remained a persistent challenge for the country. The Central Bank of Turkey frequently adjusted interest rates to control it, often facing political pressure to keep rates low. Despite these efforts, inflation rates sometimes exceeded 20% complicating economic management. And you might be asking, as to what does the future hold for Turkish economy? To my understanding, there are some key areas to watch. The very first thing which I would like to mention is basically structural reforms. You know, continuous improvements in the business environment, regulatory frameworks, and the rule of law are essential. But of course, these prerequisites are essential for all the economies, but this is particularly true for Turkey at this moment of time. Another thing which I would like to point out at this moment is diversification. You know, moving away from reliance on construction and real estate towards technology, manufacturing, and green energy will provide more stability to the economy. Another thing which, of course, Turkey cannot uh, control on its own is to have geographical stability. You know, maintaining good international relations and political stability is crucial for economic confidence. Fourth thing which I would like to point out is inflation control. You know, consistent and independent monetary policies are needed to build credibility and manage inflation effectively. Another important thing which the country might want to consider is its relations with the EU, with the European Union. So strengthening economic ties with the European Union, Turkish, which is which happens to be Turkish largest trading partner at this moment, can also bolster economic prospects for the Turkey. So brothers and sisters, Turkish economy has shown remarkable resilience over the past 30 years. With continued reforms, diversification, and stability, the future looks promising. What do you think? Is going to happen with the Turkish economy? Will Turkey overcome its challenges and achieve sustainable growth? Well, only the future can tell us exactly as to what is going to happen uh, as far as this economy is concerned. So as you know, Turkey is one of the largest economies in the world. And by 2060, after about 36 years, Turkish economy is going to be the number five economy in the world ahead of Japan. And that's going to be a surprising thing. That's an interesting thing to watch. So hopefully we expect Turkish economy to perform a lot better than now in the future. So 
Thank you so much for joining us on this journey through Turkish economic history and future prospects. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Halal Times YouTube channel for more insights, full content. And before I let you go, please don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can never miss an update. See you then, inshallah, next time. Till then, salam alaikum.